After dropping out of Michael Mann's biopic Ferrari, it looks as though Christian Bale has found his next project. Per Variety, Bale will reteam with his Out of the Furnace director Scott Cooper in the 1892 set Hostels. Cooper will write and direct the movie that tells the story of a legendary army captain who agrees to escort a dying Cheyenne war chief and his family back to tribal lands. Together, they must join forces to overcome the punishing landscape and hostile Comanche tribes that they encounter along the way. Dennis Byersell, Christian Bale, re-teaming with Scott Cooper for the movie Hostels. Oh, this is a big buy for me. I mean, I saw Out of the Furnace in the theater. It didn't do very well at no. the box office. <laughs> But, I mean, it had a great cast. You had Christian Bale, you had Casey Affleck, you had Woody Harrelson, uh, Zoe Saldana, and they were all excellent in that film. And that's the one thing that Scott Cooper excels at. He brings out the best out of his actors. He did it in Crazy Heart with Jeff Bridges. Oh, yeah. He did it most recently in Black Mass with uh, Johnny Depp and Joel Edgerton. He's going to do it again with Christian Bale. And, I'm, you know, the story sounds a little the revenant like but I, I don't have a problem with that christian i'm gonna buy it um for a lot of those reasons but i also i didn't love out of the furnace okay. um i but i do agree with you that every movie that he did this guy really works with actors very well because even black mass um whereas the movie i thought was was okay but i thought the performance by johnny depp was the best we've seen him in a very long time yeah. and you got to give that a lot of credit to the, the director as well so to hear this and i think that because of the revenant this movie has a better chance of success because that worked and you now he's not going to have the same directing style obviously um but i do think that this movie could be something i was not going to say fun but something special <laughs> uh for sure because it, to see bale teaming up and bale also when he teams up with directors minus i think the mcg situation yeah. he is he's teaming up with guys that he knows are going to enhance what he's going to bring yeah okay yeah um i absolutely agree with all the points you guys are saying i think cooper's great with actors i think it's great to see christian come back to the westerns i like 310 to yuma i was a big fan of that remake and i did like out of the furnace uh, like you did dennis uh, I, li I like what cooper i like the worlds that cooper creates mm -hmm. I, I don't he's probably uneven as a filmmaker not as great as you would well i like him to be but the, the thought the ideas and the uh, plot points and the things that he creates within his movies are interesting to watch and interesting to explore. And he finds the right actors to get real deep and play the levels of what you're watching. And Christian Bale, when he finds someone who can help that bring that out in him, mm -hmm. it's fun to watch him. And if anything Christian Bale does well, it's being the odd guy out. He always plays that part really well in whatever movie he's in, playing the odd guy out. And I think this is something that we, it will explore, and it could echo into what's going on now, the idea of you know, like indigenous people being pushed out. How does that work? The government coming over. Like, There's a lot of things that could echo into what's happening now if they do it effectively. Can we have one scene where, <coughs> where he walks up and goes, where is she? Yes. <laughs> hey, guys, if you like this clip, click here to watch the entire episode. Also, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel because it'll help you stay up to date with all the stuff we've got going on here at Collider.